Hey guys, so today what I wanted to do was a quick video on showing you how I secure my uh, capper shell from the inside, as well as a quick fix that I just did on a the capper shell door. It was loose. As far as when I shut it, I could still rattle it. And I'll show you that right now. So the latch, it used to be loose and the door would rattle. So what I did was I put plumber's tape around the latch there on the outside of well, the inside of the camper shell and that stopped the rattling and it's it doesn't move it's pretty secure now i have the are uh camper shell and mine it only has the handle in the middle it doesn't have it on the ends like i see on most videos on youtube and i couldn't find anything as far as best way to secure with a the one handle so that's why I wanted to do this video especially with the uh, plastic cover still attached um, so what I did was so let me show you here again this is outside my camper door I only had the one handle as I was saying now if you look inside this plastic covering here right around there there's a little hole and that's the only place there was really a hole at. So I got another S hook and attached it to a little chain. I measured it out. Okay, now, and I attached that S hook inside that hole with that chain dangling down. Okay, so as far as, uh, securing my camper from the inside. I bought this chain right here at Lowe's and just wrapped it around the uh, clamp that goes on top of, or on the camper shell, connecting it to the truck. I got this turnbuckle. I also bought this S, S hook and I closed the ends on both the ends after I got the chain in and the turnbuckle through. And I got a S hook yeah, that's a, that I put right here on the other end. And it's smaller than the other end, but I'm gonna probably eventually replace it. So I'm gonna have to fasten the other one so I can really show you that how secure it gets. But um, you put this one in, same way, just the opposite side. Turn the turnbuckle. And now when I go to open it, see it ain't it ain't going nowhere. And that's the way it looks. It's really not doing anything. It's not taking up really any room or anything. Now when I get on the outside and just show you. See, it's not moving at all. Can't get it to open. So it's pretty secure. And one more thing I did was uh, the plastic piece up here that is inside the door of the camper. I drilled a hole and just put a little S hook. Let's see, it comes right out. But, uh, Yeah, you just put it like that, and then when you open the door, you can just set the chain up on it. Yeah, the same on this side. And it's easier to shut the door because you ain't got the chains dangling. So I hope that information was beneficial to you and that now you know how to lock your, uh, or you have another idea basically on how to lock your camper from the inside and as well as the quick fix with the latch on the camper shell. And if you've got any questions, any comments, please leave them. Uh, please give me a like and subscribe to my channel. And I'd love to take you along for this journey and look forward to seeing you on the next video. Bye.